this is Domingo36, and today I'm going to be showing you how to build overflow protection for your storage system, sorting system, or whatever else you might like to use it for. So this is very useful if, say, you've got an iron farm and your storage system's filling up, it's almost full, it's starting to back up into the hoppers, and it's very important that it doesn't fill up um, to your sorter because, you know, you need to sort out the poppies and Relo reload the chunks or whatever. Um, there's a trick at the nether portals, but um, it's just very important that you don't over the system doesn't overflow with items, and that's where this comes in. So we're um, yeah, all the hoppers except the one where above the overflow protection are filled up. So um, we're just going to um, put some more iron in and see what happens. Okay, so as you saw, when the items, the item amount in here went up to, um, 23, this, um, the system activated and items started getting dispensed into lava. They were drawn out of this hopper from your um, item flow, your um, item pipeline, and put into a dropper which is set to dispense items into lava whenever items go in it. So if I just were to stick some birch planks in here, um, then it would dispense them out. Yeah, I'm not sure what's wrong right now, but, um, maybe it's too fast, um, I don't know, but, um, yes, there's also an indicator light to show when you have overflow, so, um, you know, you could have a sign or whatever, overflow, and then it would, um, yeah, that turns off once it's done dealing with the items. So, um, now for the tutorial. What you're going to need is, um, of course, well, your chest, which is where your storage system is, um, your ho a hopper, several hoppers, but one hopper for the overflow protection, a dropper, some, um, a bunch of building blocks. I like stained glass around the lava. And yes, you're going to also need a lava bucket. Some red, um, a few redstone dust. Uh, three, rep four repeaters. No, sorry. Three repeaters. Three comparators. One redstone torch. And, it, um, for the indicator light, of course, a redstone lamp. So, um, we'll just come up a few blocks over here and, um, grab our building block and then, um, we need to find the hopper line that our items are going into. So, say this was our whole storage system and we've got, um, this is our hopper line that's bringing items in. Um, and that will be our input chest. So, what we're going to do is on um, this corner um, hopper, it needs to turn around so that the um, it, so that the redstone does not interfere with the other part of the hopper line. Um, so at that cur at that um, corner of the pipeline, we're going to want to come off diagonally to one side, and then go two blocks over, and one block up diagonally like that, and then face the comparator out of that hopper, two redstone dust there, and um, you, your indicator go light goes here, so we will just grab a redstone lamp, plunk that down right there, then put a redstone torch off that second block. A, um, another hopper there, facing into a dropper, then build a little um, area for your lava here, just a little pod, 
surrounding one block, put some lava in the center, close it off, whatever you like, then you're going to want to make the clock to dispense your items, so just place eight blocks around the dropper, like that, um, but on the side of the dropper, let me get in, okay, then um, face a comparator running out of that dropper into a repeater, into a comparator, put the comparator in subtract mode, and then I'm going to have this actually on the other side so that we can run the redstone around, so three redstone just like that, a redstone just there, and a redstone repeater there, and that will make up our uh, rapid item dispensing, and then you're just going to want um, a two more blocks there, and a block next to that hopper, redstone dust on both of those, then put um, that a block there to separate the redstone, and that should do it. So, um, let's just uh, say this is where it ends um, for, you know, just our purposes, and that this hopper will be filled up, and then we're going to put in items into the chest, and, um, yes, you're going to see that the items start getting dispensed into lava. So there you go. Um, all the extra iron is getting taken out and sped out into the system. So, there you go. Um, don't know why the items were not showing up. Let's just put them... There you go. Um, so now you can see them getting dispensed into the lava. And it'll tick down until there are 22 items, because that is the redstone threshold. Um, and as soon as more come in, they will get um, dispensed out. So I hope you found this video helpful. Um, thank you for watching, and I will see you later. Goodbye.